Hey, hey guys, welcome back to the Eagles t Nest here, my down 13. Let's get back to some Firewatch here. I really like that intro. Um, I just thought I'd post that before I did this one. I really enjoy this game. I've only gotten so far to it so far. And, good morning, um, Henry. Well, I guess good afternoon. I, I just had to. Like I just had to. Anyway, uh, there's still the a few hours of daylight so to get cool. some work in. I can see you at your desk, so call me when you're ready. Hey, sorry, guess I slept in. You got a relaxing, what, 14 hours of sleep? Woo! Yeah, Jesus, I guess it's what, six? 6.45. Whoops. Don't worry about it, that hike puts everyone out of commission for a day or two. But now that you're up, let me quickly get you acquainted with the job. There's a thing in the middle of your room with a round map on it, do you see it? Okay, yeah, I see it. This is the Osborne Firefinder, invented in 1914 by W.E. Osborne? You use this to spot, you guessed it, fi- What the fuck? What is it? Nothing, um, you, uh, you use this to- Oh, fuck me! Good God, language, lady. Out your west-facing window, are you seeing what I'm seeing? Are those fucking fireworks? Oh my gosh, that's a huge fire hazard. Jeez. Whoa, that's not legal, right? Uh, no. You need to get down there right now and stop them. Fire danger is through the fucking roof. Is that really my job? Your job is whatever I say it is. Look, the closest ranger is like two days away. Go down there and set them straight. All right, we're going. Do I write him a, write ticket? Him a ticket? Easy there, Dirty Harry. Well? Get going. You'll probably need a rope to get down the shale between you and the lake, if I remember right. There should be one in the supply box on the way. The code is 1234. It's actually that for all of them. Convenient. Convenient. That's one word for it. Where are we going? Oh, okay, so we take this to 306. Lake Trail. Nice. Nice name. Couldn't come up with a, a more interesting lake name, but Lake Trail, I guess, will do. Let's see what I can talk to her. Oh. See, I, I really like how they put a lot of detail in the atmosphere. How about you're, you're by yourself in your own watchtower, you know, like a mile away from the other watchtower. And, um, you know, I just really like how they made this game. Oh, there's our supply box. I found the supply box. Great. One, two, three, eight. It's king. It's four. All right. Let's get this down on the map. Here's a note. Hey, I found a note to a guy named Ron from some guy Dave. That's probably Dave Gaskell. He's completely nuts. Is that right? Harmless, but yeah, yeah. One of those, you know, fall off the grid and eat ants for a week type. Totally fucking cuckoo. Which is kind of what the job attracts. Alright. Keep this. I tracked down that rope. It was right where you said. Great. So you should be set to get down to the lake. Hey, there's a snack in here. I'm probably gonna eat it. You definitely do not want to do that. Whatever's in there has been in there for years. That's how you get food poisoning. Oh. Let's... let's eat it. <laughs> Just ate something that's been in there for a couple of years. What's up, buddy? Get out of there. 
All right, let's let's go to show those those girls who's boss. Um, does it matter which way we take? Let's see here. I guess it really doesn't matter. Uh, that looks like it's a long way around. Let's take this way. This shale slide is steep. How do you expect me to get down this? I don't remember it being that bad. It's not even named on our topos. Widow shit boss. <laughs> what about shitty boss is gonna get me killed, Hill? Oh, is that Absorka Indian? Maybe, maybe Creek? That's actually English for not in my job description. Right, the radio is still good though. Hey. What the hell's wrong with you? My shitty boss almost got me killed. First, your boss is a delight. Secondly, Jesus. What exactly happened? My rope snapped coming down the shale slide. You didn't break anything, did you? No, I think I'll make it. You'll be careful for Christ's sake. Down, trying. Giving me bad ropes here. Wow, there's a, a big rock outcropping down here near the lake. It's really something. Yeah, makes for good camping. There beer used to be cans. a group of guys who would boulder out there a couple times a year. Finding a bunch of empty beer cans. They threw them all over hell. The idiots down at the lake? Yeah, them. I just found where they're hanging out. What's this? Come on. They left their packs tied up here. Don't fuck with them. The last thing we need is some hikers filing a report about harassment. Wow. They left a fire unattended. Oh, look. They decided to have a campfire, too. You know, they color-coded the fire danger signs in case people were illiterate. But I guess that doesn't take into account just plain stupid, does it? Found the fireworks. They didn't even try to hide them. Ugh. Confiscate. Well, confiscate them. Yeah, you bet. I already did. Well, they left their clothes out to dry. It looks like uh, two people. Well, uh, what if they're naked? Won't that be exciting? Oh. Look, they're obviously still there, so tell them off and then head back. I found a bra. A nudie pyromaniac. Remain <laughs> professional. Why would they leave all their stuff on the... That's gross. Uh, there are... Full of uh, dirt. Panties. There are what? <laughs> he drops them. I don't want to say that <laughs> word again. Why? Because you're 12? Ooh. There's a... Ooh. Yes? There are two naked ladies out here. Can you handle that? I like how Come she on. whispers too. I like too. naked ladies, same as anyone, but there's... Oh. You know. What the hell are they doing? Two? Yeah. I found them in the lake. Skinny dipping? Yeah. Stereos. <laughs> Seriously, it was expensive. Seriously, it was expensive. Fucking cool it with the fireworks. Please just put it down. We won't light anymore. This guy's creepy, Chelsea. Can I throw it in the water? You probably have a tiny dick. Wow. Chelsea, it's my boombox. You, you <laughs> Firework, and it won't be your stereo, Iraq. <laughs> oh, fuck you, psycho. Yeah, fuck you. Jeez. You'll fucking pay for this. You can't just harass girls in the woods. 
Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> Trip through the radio in the water. Hey, that go okay? Uh, might have got a, little, have hot. Got a little hot. <laughs> What's a little hot? Some of their personal property took a swim. Ugh. Well, I can't do anything about it now. Nope. Thanks for dealing with him, though. Seriously. No problem. Where, where am I trying to go here? Oh, okay, so I made it to that lake. Thunder Canyon. Alrighty, sounds good. There's a lot of specific detail to this game, like the water sound, so the rock sound, I the little crumbs. I have a bit of a confession to make. Oh, what, what is it? Um, look, I was I was drunk last night when I welcomed you to the job. Yeah, well, you're not the first boss to be guilty of that. I know. I just I know I can get a little pushy, you know, putting you on the spot about uh, why you're out here and stuff. Not a big deal. It's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll keep that sort of a thing to, uh, to a minimum. Anyway, let me know when you get back to your lookout. Oh. Hey, I heard some thunder. Yeah, Are I've we... got eyes on a storm out to the north. Well, that's bad, right? Because of the lightning? It just means we'll be busy. Hurry home, and try not to get hit by lightning. Oh, wow. Thunder Canyon is actually Thunder Canyon. I got hit by lightning when I was nine years old, so I'm safe. It's not gonna strike twice, all that. Well, there was an old lookout named Roy Sullivan who got hit by lightning seven times. I don't like the sound of that. Yeah, well, if it makes you feel any better, it wasn't what killed him. What killed him? Suicide. Would you believe? Defend our frontier. What do we got in here? A horn. Yeah, I get the sense that not everything in here is useful. In the boxes? Why's that? I don't really know what I'll do with the deer horn. Firstly, they're called antlers, and secondly, stay out here long enough and you'll get creative. I found a flashlight. There's one in there? Oh, great. Well, great. the sun's gonna go down soon, so if the batteries still work, you're in luck. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with this. Can I keep it? No, I can't keep it. I guess we'll take you. Hey. I'll take him on the ride. What's in this cave down here? In Thunder Canyon? Thunder Canyon? Hey, I didn't name it. But in the cave? I don't know, rocks? NFS tells people not to go too far in there. It's pretty dangerous. This cave is gated off. It's to stop spelunkers from dying without getting the keys from the Forest Service office first. Makes sense. Although, Debbie says she lost them like three years ago, so... Maybe its mysteries are locked away for good. Oh, that's too bad. We could go skating in Colorado a lot with someone. Would be really nice to pick that back up. Hello! You gonna play with the cave's echo? Hmm. I bless the rings down, down in, in Africa! Africa! <laughs> oh, way. They put that song in here. That's good. That's cool. Let's keep on moving up here. Let's get back to the tower. There's some obstacle up there. Let's go like that. Oh. What the hell? There's some guy out here giving me the creeps. That is the creepy. Creeps? Wait, he's looking at you? Is he doing anything else? I, I don't Whoa. think so. Henry, there's 
there's there's something I something oh boy. someone should have told comes. you about this area. Haunted. What is it? It's outside. Oh. Come on. <laughs> thing. And people come and go as they please. It's <laughs> it's, it's it's madness. Yeah, yeah, okay. I get it. Look, bumping into someone in what the middle of nowhere ass. is part of the fun. <laughs> I wonder who that guy was. Can I... Well, what path do I take? Do I take this? This one. This guy's climbing without any ropes or anything. He's got balls. over here. Whoa. What's this? <laughs> I don't think there's any fictional character I hate more than Forrest Benji. Burns. Henry, as an employee of the Forest Service, that is treason. Yeah, well, he really freaked me out Can as I a kid. Can I put him in here? He inspired me to spend the bulk of my 30s keeping the wilderness safe. A shrink would have a field day with you. <laughs> uh, oh, boy. Let me put him, I'm going to put him in here. Oh. Sounds good. He looks good. He looks like he's having a good time in there. So this generator is all the power I've got out here. Yep. It doesn't go through much gas and, <laughs> well, you don't have much in the way of electronics, so... What about my hair dryer? Oh, I'm sorry. You might just have to make peace with frizzy locks. Oh, I could my never. my typewriter doing? Uh... What can I do for you? Well, my typewriter is on the ground, outside of my tower. You right? Yeah, look, uh, the wind? No. How the hell? You should get inside. Fuck me. Whoa. Someone broke in. They what? They just, they Holy wrecked the crap. place, threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker. This place is Holy rain shit. Bag. Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. Crap. This place is ransacked. My fucking sheets are gone! They stole your sheets? That's just mean. Okay, I put in a call. Well, what can they do about it? W will they catch whoever did it? This is the Forest Service, Henry. They're not exactly Hawaii 5 -0. Do you have any idea who would have done this? Maybe that guy I saw in the canyon, but I don't know why the fuck he'd want to mess with my stuff. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a man hiking on his own and question him if they find him. Uh, I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires, and that's about it. And now I've got to worry about some deranged hiker going after lookouts? Great. Uh, okay, in the morning I'm going to call my friend Patty, who works the desk down in Cody. They keep a list of everyone who's officially been in and out of the trailhead since... I don't know, forever, and see if we can get a list of names. We won't get much, but at least if anything else happens, we can refer to it and see if anything comes up. Thanks. I need you to feel safe out here. I just point into the to Forest Service gun. weapons cache and I'll feel safer than the Pope in his little car. <laughs> yeah, uh, someone made the choice years ago that leaving people with infinite amounts of alone time and a gun... It was kind of a bad idea. True. Right. That is true. I'll see what I can do. Where, where's her tower? Oh, day two. Alright guys, I'm going to end the episode right here. Uh, click subscribe, like, and uh, watch for more updates. I'm going to finish this game. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy.